The interest in acquiring Type 74 tanks aligns with Japan's forward-thinking approach to modernizing its defense capabilities by incorporating advanced technologies such as unmanned aerial systems to replace traditional platforms. It is important to note that the retirement of the Type 74 tank in the L-1J combat utility helicopter by Japan coincided with the same time. With their plans to decommission AWAN's Cobra attack helicopters, this reflects Japan's commitment to developing defense strategies and implementing the most advanced technology while the Type 74 tank may look old and durable. The effectiveness demonstrated reliability and durability synonymous with Japanese engineering that the Philippine Army considered. These tanks underscore the trust placed in Japanese military equipment. The potential for this collaboration is expansive. Beyond tanks, with Japan's willingness to provide other assets such as the A-1's Cobra attack helicopter, A-1J Hoi helicopter, and locally produced A-1J combat utility helicopter, this offer if realized could contribute significantly to the capabilities of the armed forces of the Philippines. Japan's provision of air search radar to the Philippine military is an important step in defense cooperation. This collaboration not only strengthens the Philippines' defense capabilities but also marks the resumption of historical restrictions on the Philippine military. The dynamic nature of bilateral relations especially in the defense sector underscores the Philippine Army's potential to expand its armored vehicle fleet. Consideration of the Type 74 tank with its proven track record adds depth to Ono's discussion as does any prospective military acquisition. The transition from proposal to reality requires careful planning negotiations and official confirmation. The Philippine Army's interest in the Type 74 tank remains a conceptual plan until there are clear indications of implementation as discussions progress. It will be interesting to observe the strategic implications of such collaboration on regional security dynamics. The shared commitment to modernization and interoperability between Japan and the Philippines opens a new chapter in defense cooperation. In conclusion, the Philippine Army's potential acquisition of Type 74 tanks from Japan represents a significant development in the ever-evolving regional landscape. Defense partnership The mutual benefits arising from this collaboration have the potential to reshape the capabilities and dynamics of the armed forces of both countries. Building a stronger and more integrated defense framework, this evolving narrative shows a complex interplay between diplomatic initiatives, defense strategies, and efforts to achieve cutting-edge military capabilities highlighting the complex landscape of international relations in the 21st century. Defense ties between Japan and the Philippines are growing stronger as the two countries move closer to a bilateral agreement resembling the recently formulated Philippine Visiting Forces Agreement. The Reciprocal Access Agreement outlined a process that would allow the deployment of Japanese troops in the Philippines to be countered by the deployment of Filipino troops in Japan before the Philippine Army expressed interest in acquiring Japanese Type 74 tanks marking them as target's major acquisition with aspirations for additional medium main battle tank or light tank unit fleets. The Philippine Army finds its current order of Sabra tanks, both the use and trajectory variants of the Israeli Elbit system limited, to be insufficient according to information received.